Well, in honor of Veterans Day tomorrow, St. Joseph held an annual parade dedicated to those who serve. KQ2's Noel Hardin has more from this year's parade. To celebrate those who have served this country, the Veterans Day Parade invites veterans, bands, and the public to watch and celebrate those who have done service. No, I just got out because I'm just tired. A little bit tired. And then my, my military, the job I had, they stopped it because there was nuclear weapons. Veterans from all different branches were present and all came from a variety of backgrounds and had interesting stories to share. We were the first uh, combat Marines into Vietnam in March 7th of 65. And uh, I was there till October. And it was kind of strange being the first ones there because we really had no idea what was going on. But uh, uh, you learn real fast in that situation. Many veterans living in St. Joseph stated that it is a great place to live for those who served and offered plenty of support to those who needed it. I come out here every year for the last four years and I enjoy it. And I, I think a lot of pe more people should come out because this is a good community, good place to live. I moved from Detroit, Michigan to here, so I really like this city. St. Joseph will continue to support the veterans who live here and will continue the parade to honor all the service members who have fought for our freedom. And today is also the Marine Corps birthday and uh, 248 years. And uh, so a lot of people were hollering, uh, happy birthday Marines and everything. And that's good. Reporting in St. Joseph, I'm Noel Harden from KQ2 News. You can still continue to show your support for veterans by supporting local veteran resources or by visiting veteranbenefits.mo.gov.